Do you remember this little dog guy here? Ever wonder why he was there? I mean, I don't know why he was there, but he this wasn't his the first thing he ever came from. I remember being really annoyed by it. Like after a while in the in that box you just start scratching at the floor and you could hear it and you'd have to search through all your open windows to see where he where this little guy was hanging out so you could close the window and shut him up. But anyway, before he was in the Microsoft XP search uh, window, he was in Microsoft Bob. So this is Microsoft Bob, and there he is. There's Rover. So I've set this up already. So basically, Microsoft Bob was kind of like a... Um, it, it was like a, a decoration over Windows. So it had a bunch of its own applications that it came with, but you could also launch applications from inside it. But it's all set up as like a home that you decorate. So this was kind of like my Sims as a kid. You know, you just decorate all these rooms with random bullshit and, you know, just kind of have fun setting up your computer like that and you can launch everything you would want, like all your games or other applications right from inside Bob. And so yeah, let's uh, let's go check it out. So yeah, you start out in a room like this. It gives you a little hint, you know, little tips and tricks about, you know, how to, how to do stuff in Bob. You can just click on stuff to do stuff. So furniture, you can just kind of redecorate it. Doors will bring you to other rooms. Yeah, so let's just let's just get it going. So right here on the desk, we're in the study right now. Over here is all the boring programs. You know, Bob Financial Guide. So yeah, you can you, you can input all of your financial information and I have Bob sorted out for you. So do I own any bonds? Let's uh let's buy some bonds. I own fifteen million dollars in bonds. Oh no, that's just the issuer name. My issuer is fifteen million. Mr. Fifteen million. Yeah, so th this is this is dumb. We don't care about any of this. But yeah, you can just kind of organize stuff. Oh, look at that. Behind the grandfather clock, there is a safe. What's in the safe? A lava lamp. And another financial advisor thing and the checkbook and a clock. Boring. Okay, let's move on. So yeah, this is like the public study. Anyone who sets it up and you know sets up a name on your computer can go here but you can also have your own private rooms so i've got a private kids room so you can see i've got i've got our game set up over here it's in a box here we'll open that later you know there's an attic up there and my toy box get a little duck down here wood duck oh but What's that behind the duck? <gasps> a mouse hole. So yeah, there's not much in this mouse hole right now. Let's uh, let's decorate it. Let's uh let's give the mouse who lives here a little a little decoration. So yeah, every room and all the decorations in the room can be of one of the different styles. Um for the most part, you know, that the objects mostly look best in the type of room that it's in. So, well, let's give the... Oh, he's already got a little cheese table here. Does Mousey want a photo? Yeah, let's give him a photo of space. Whoa. Oh, so yeah, you can just kind of... If you want to make a room that just has this as the background, you can do that. Can I, can I resize this maybe? Change it. So yeah, kind of a lot of hoops you have to go around to 
just resize stuff. You can't just kind of drag things from the corner. Now let's put that on the wall. Let's move it farther away so it's behind the thing there. Actually, yeah, there we go. A little picture of space. Geo Safari. So I think I think like back in the day that you could actually get this little Geo Safari machine and it would have like geography games. Oh, and so Elephant Dude shows up to uh, play with us. Greetings. Welcome to Geo Safari where discovery is fun. All right, what do we want to be quizzed on? I'm going to do terrible on any of these. Let's learn about some USA states. Okay, ready? <laughs> oh, yeah, I didn't realize he was so uh, so British. Ready? You scale will be given precisely three chances to answer each question. Enjoy the flick. I guess that was a flick. The name of that state. Oh boy. It's not Tennessee. It's right above it. Is that... Kentucky? Hey, I got it! Okay, yeah, that, that, that one's a little easy. Just once you get into the middle section here, that's that's when it gets hard. All right, that's enough Geo Safari. You get the idea. See you later. And then Rover comes back, but we can actually change the, our uh, our partner. So there's a whole bunch of guys we can switch. We can switch with Blythe, the uh, Firefly. Oh. <laughs> Chaos the cat. Hopper the bunny. I think it's like a stuffed animal bunny. Yeah, squeaky. I, I, I think I remember I used to like to go with Hopper. Oh, I like this guy. Java. Java. Hey, Dino? Look. Dino from Guatemala City? Yeah, let's go with him. Oh, sad to see you go, Rover. Okay. Okay. Oops. Oh, well, I think I just... Yeah. I changed the resolution. Don't worry about it. I think we're okay. So let's make a new room. Let's get crazy with it. So there's all kinds of rooms we can make. So we've already got a contemporary kids' room. We can make a postmodern kids' room. Look at that. Retro. I guess that's a kids' room. Let's, eh, I guess you got to decorate it yourself. And a castle. Yes, yeah, so you can see they're all very different styles, so that the objects that go in them will only fit certain things. Let's make a castle family room. Onward! Yeah, let's make it private. A relaxing place for all the residents of the castle. Oh, so it does come with stuff in it. But we can... We can, we can make it our own. Some very generic boxes. I guess that's a car. Wait. There's a chair there. That's not this. Is that the same chair? Is it just. Is it secretly backwards? That's weird. <laughs> like that castle computer. Let's do it. Hey. How do I. There's gotta be a shortcut. Oh, uh, yeah. If you right click, you can just resize. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> the chair's part of the table. That's. That's sneaky. That was made specifically for this room to be put in this configuration. Can I get rid of your... Oh, yeah. So I can hide that. Cool. Let 
Yeah, of course we're gonna have some. Oh, that's spices. That's not spices. Mm -hmm. Why is it cut off? Like a lot of the castle things, I think, were very specifically made to go in certain. Like to go in the foreground, which is unfortunate. So these doors, I don't think these doors, yeah, they don't go anywhere yet. I gotta tell it where to go. So that'll go back to my kids' room. Mm -hmm. And this, we can. Oh, we gotta make a new room to, for it to go to. Alright, let's not do castle this time. Outside is just blank. Let's go in a postmodern garage. Oh yeah. This is where we get our work done. I don't like that car. Let's change it. We can change it into literally any other object. Yeah. Let's get that hot rod. Yeah, that's the stuff. What else we got? Lava lamps. Can never have too many lava lamps. Here's a hint. Oh, press control D. Oh, cool. Some items do stuff when you click on it. be my hood ornament. Yeah. So what else can we do in here? It's advanced features. Ah, uh, it's boring stuff. Yeah. So yeah, I had a ton of fun just as a kid just designing a home with a bunch of, you know, secret rooms and, you know, tidy shelves with all of my games on them. It was, it was a lot of fun back in the day. Alright, so I guess this will go back to... The castle room. But let's just, uh... Let's get started with our shivers, why don't we? Oh no! Oh, uh, that's right. I don't have the CD-ROM in yet. I can fix that. I mean, I have the CD in. I just, uh... 